just you turn to a channel and then suddenly it's just like you're thrown into a boss fight with five giant Wario's. I oh my god that would that would be hell but like that would actually be funny you can't lie. Just like five Wario's. Who are these people? Uh. No, no, no. Go back to the characters. Okay, I guess you're not gonna do that. Okay, because I want to know who these people are. I need to know about these people. Uh. Summer, Wraith, uh, Skewer, and this application has stopped responding. Yeah, I think they changed Skewer a bit. Yeah, they definitely did. There's, uh, the infection. Oh my gosh, it's PB! The, the Trojan, that's the name, the Trojan. Which I'm surprised it's called the Trojan, considering the fact that that was also the name of, uh, Luigi inside of Five Nights at Wario's The Abandoned Factory Project Nevermore. So, I... I guess How Ray was it? actually that lazy. <laughs> or thought that it just fix him. Dude, we need... Security Yoshi. No, what happened to Yoshi? No, no, I want my Yoshi. <laughs> I want to know about... No, I like really how they didn't even give a name for this. It's, their name is just Bowser. Okay, can you go back to Yoshi, because I'm trying to read the lore? Security pretty... Yoshi is the mascot of a Yoshi security brand that your family loves dearly. And NZ realizes this and has taken the form of Yoshi security to torment you. Stories say the real se security Yoshi is still alive, hiding away somewhere. Okay. I want the old one. That Okay, now I want to see what the fuck... This... No, I want to know... Okay, no, well, actually... Another entity taking the form of Mario from the casino timeline. He has one large all-seeing eye and his mustache floats in play. <laughs> a third hand with an eye seems to be hidden inside his chest. Teleports his victims around for a game of cat and mouse. Do, 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 do. Wait, I thought I... No, no, it isn't. Okay. I thought for a second that was Jevil. Wait, wait, hold on. Oh, wait, never mind. Hold the gram no, 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 the no. gramophone. Tends to resembling a young girl named Ashley with a gramopho gramophone implanted into her face. She is also interested in composing music, and her song is now what she plays when she demands for her favorite thing. How does she food, eat? feed her quickly. How does she eat? Do you just shove it down the gramophone? I guess. Also, go back Bird. to the wraith. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, okay. Look how fucking edgy as shit this motherfucker is. Oh my gosh. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, wait, hold on. Never mind. I thought he was like a serial killer. Go back to Birdo now. We need to go back to Birdo. Birdo looks like a serial killer. Birdo, the possessed by a Birdo, once a friendly and flirtatious dinosaur. She is now a ravenous butcher with a chainsaw attached to her severed hand. She was granted a third eye that emerges from her back, likely to make her a more efficient killer. Effective. Then we have Boshi. Boshi is a rude and crude counterpart. Yoshi is now dangerous, feral Yoshi who is a silent but effective killer. His nose and mouth were sealed. Oh god. Look at the mouth. Just like, bleh. Where? Sealed to the limit. To the noise he makes, not that he needs to breathe right now anyways. Nabbit, a purple rabbit that escaped from Katie's purgatory. Ready to finish the job, he seems to have drastically changed after coming into this timeline in life. He was a thief who gave layout plans to the one who robbed Wario's establishment. Okay. The Giant. <laughs> giant entity created by com combining the spirits of multiple entities from different universes. He devours victims. 
with the help of his arm and his mouth, lots of damage and death can caused by this colossal threat. This is just a regular girl? Yeah. Pianissima. Okay. Wait. Oh, this one's the glitch. The glitch and the Trojan are much different. Oh. Yeah. Okay, I How thought they were- How did you not notice that? Because, like, there was something with his face. Because they used the same fucking base of the Five Nights at Wears 3 model. I like- I mean, some of these are Orneo lore, and the- I mean, this seems like an Orneo lore thing. That's- wait. This is Incredibox- there, now I'm wondering what- now I see why there's so many lore pages for Incredibox fonts, or at least when the one with Boshi and Birdo. Wait, what happened to like- yeah. So are like, Yoshi, Birdo, and Bowser just past victims, I think? No, uh, Boshi, I think it's a past victim? But no, uh, Birdo's a past victim, Yoshi was a different entity taking the likeness of Yoshi. Yoshi is still alive. Boshi's a victim, Birdo's a victim, what happened to the Bowser? Because I think Bowser Bowser's possessed. Victim. That counts as a victim. Uh, Nabbit is technically a victim. Yeah. Uh, honestly, we need more victims. But probably, well we have, we have a, I don't know, fucking, I, okay. If this hap- if the same exact thing happens These to me again, where there's, like, two or three entities attacking me at once, and I literally have to lose, and I just can't do anything, I am going to just quit playing this mode. I'm actually going to just start smashing my monitor, he says. Um, and, um, and by the way, um, if I stop playing this game mode, I'm gonna be going and playing the, um, classic mode. Because here's the thing about classic mode. It's a really good, it's a really good idea for a mode. The, the thing I don't like about it is the, is how it, how, like, the, the camera buttons are so bad. I really hate the, I really hate the sort of, um sticky note map layout that it has. And also, in the original game, the en a lot of the entities were really just dumb. I don't know if they kept... I don't know if they kept Mario and Luigi, but if they did, that mechanic was fucking stupid. Okay, actually... No, it- Oh my god, I just checked! I just fucking checked! Are you kidding me? We know the fourth victim now, the monitor. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Please take time to study the figures on screen. Holy shit, I need to... Um, I have- okay, so, for the past 32 minutes, if the music was louder than Justin, I'm sorry. Um, if that happened- Mario and Luigi were- essentially, the timing on them was- literally made the game impossible. Wait, wasn't Cabin Fever the one where, like, Bowser got set on fire or some shit? That was the second one. That was Final Fantasy Warriors 2. No, there was like one that involved like a visual novel, all that shit. And then like, it ended up in a fire, I think. 
That was the second one. Of this series, or? Of Five Nights at Warriors 2. The, like, that's like the lore of Five Nights at Warriors. It happened in both, actually. No, there was like a fucking one. There wasn't a visual novel in Five Nights at Warriors 2. What? No, I mean. I mean, separate to the actual games itself. Yeah, but which one was the. The second one to this? The second one for Financial Warriors 2! Bowser literally caught fire! I don't think we're talking about the same one, but the one where, like, Mario takes Peach on a picnic and then, like. Th oh, that's. Dies. Oh, that was fucking, uh, Pro Project Nevermore. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> 2 a.m.? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> I'm so fucking over this. Dude. I'm so fucking over this bullshit, I swear. Honestly, I should have a game like this where, like, oh my god, I just, it's one just, mechanic I'm getting is so luck. fucking close to just saying fuck it and just not play this anymore, not play this mode anymore, because this is getting really fucking infuriating. He's gonna look for a second update. I mean, I unlike unlike the. I mean, I can I can take my time with this. I don't think I have to beat it anytime soon. Unlike the other one where it's like the next thing I have to do. I literally checked over and over. Literally just checked. Luigi appears. Fucks up my day. Fucking hell, I'm tired of this. One more attempt. Same thing happens. This night, I'm fucking done. And I'm just trying a different time. For two things. If two things happen again, I'm fucking done. Playing this mode for now. Actually, you know what? I shouldn't, you know what? I shouldn't get mad at it that much. I can literally go out and, uh, I can literally go out and it won't be that big of a deal. So yeah, the Ouija one was just my bad. Uh, I'm, yeah. <laughs> Don't ask. But that was the mating call of a fa -la -la. I don't know what you're talking about, dude. Do you not know what a fa -la -la is? No. It's that little, like, pink blob guy that can, that can hover in, um... That can fucking, mm -hmm. um, Kirby's right back at you. Called it. Okay. Okay. I'm keeping a lookout on.
God, I don't... Oh, God. I, I remember I saw a video, and I knew when I... I'm like, oh, my God. Please don't tell me this guy is actually agreeing with... It was a misinput. Fuck it. Oh, I'm an idiot. Please take time to study the figures on the screen. So I met, I accidentally went into the, um, clicked the wrong thing when it came to the rape. I found one YouTube video and I'm like, oh my god, please don't tell me you're agreeing with this guy. Then when I actually saw the video in quest, I'm like, oh, it's a reaction video. Thank god. I've been find one of those people that are so fucking stupid that they, like, that they take the title as, like, the dumbest YouTuber that has ever existed. In your opinion. My opinion? What, wait, what's the question? It's like, I, essentially, what is the dumbest YouTuber that has ever graced the platform, in your opinion? I don't know, there's a lot of stupid ones. <laughs> My pick is a YouTuber that is literally a clinically woke idiot that is so stupid that he literally cannot ever get a good job out there. Like, it's on Avi? Like, it's, it's a one-and-done thing. No one would hire him because of how stupid he is. Hassan Abi? No. I, oh. you motherfucker! I. Yeah. No. That That's stupid. This is... This is... Yeah, I'm- I'm done. I'm not playing this mode. I've had way too much fucking bullshit the night before.